the alibis of a relieved drug enforcement group chief slash brigadier general and a former Calabarzon drug enforcement head and police colonel, both of whom were on the scene of the crime and captured on video in October last year, did not fly with the investigative panel that recommended charges against them. And yet, as our Patrick de Jesus reports, both are optimistic to be exonerated in a fair and speedy trial. Some cops who were criminally charged before the office of the Ombudsman by the PNP and Napolcom have issued statements. This is in connection to the 990 kilos of crystal meth seized in Manila last year. Those charged include former PNP Drug Enforcement Group Chief Police Brigadier General Narciso Domingo who expressed sadness saying it seemed their effort to seize the almost one-ton drugs was disregarded wherein their former member, Police Master Sergeant Rodolfo Mayo Junior was arrested. Inilala po natin yung mga involved at nireport natin sila sa ginaukulan sa SITG 990 at kasama na po yung uh, CCTV footage is actual uh, recordings okay. for the past uh, seven days. Fortunately, pinagdudahan pa tayo na kasabot dito sa mga sindikato. But then, uh, I welcome this development kahit paano po ay uh, may proof po natin sa proper forum na hindi po tayo kasali dito. In fact, tayo nga po ang nakahuli at nag-report ng uh, incident na yan. Domingo hopes that there will be a speedy trial of their case as his retirement is nearing in May next year. Kasi uh, mahirap yung uh, retired ka na eh, nasa probinsya ka na eh. Mag-aatin ka pa ng mga court hearings. So we'll be uh, requesting for a speedy trial. This is the same sentiment of former PDEC RSOU Calabarzon Chief Police Colonel Julian Olonan but he said he is ready to answer the complaint. Siguro it's a normal process, ano, kung ano man ang nakita ng Napol ko, may respeto ko po at uh, sasagutin na lang po namin. Yung mga kakilala ko, marami talaga na sumusuporta sa akin, naniniwala. Yun na lang ma'am ang nakakapag uh, high moral sa akin, no? pagbigay ng lakas ng loob para lumaban. At the same time, my family, sabi ko wag maniniwala sa ano kung sakali man, especially mga anak ko, di ba, mayroong mga wag maniniwala kasi hindi totoo. Up to 50 cops were charged with criminal cases as the result of the joint investigation conducted by the fact-finding team of NAPOLCOM and Special Investigation Task Group of the PNP. Administrative cases are also set to be filed against them as the NAPOLCOM has started its pre-charged investigation. Patrick De Asus for The Nation. <laughs>